Hi guys, this is Sophie from Let's Enhance, and today I'm happy to present Creative, our first generative AI upscaler. It's our step forward comparing to traditional upscalers as it allows additional controls using prompts, using creativity controls that can allow to introduce more dramatic and drastic changes to your images. It takes the image as a reference and redraws the image by introducing some of the small missing details. Therefore, it works the best with art, with old characters, smaller photos, you name it. It's still in beta, but let me show you how it works and how to get the max out of it. Let's start. So first, I need to upload an image and I will be using some of, of my one of my most favorite characters, Super Mario. I used to play a lot when I was a kid. And uh, let's upload it to our system. Okay, so it's ready to be processed. So in our upscaling types, you need to select Creative Beta. We do 2x upscaling by default, but you can change these parameters in the system setting. And here comes the controllers that you need to select. So first, we got the image type. We have photo, digital art, and text. It's a different workflows that were specifically trained for these types of photos. In our case, Super Mario is closest to the digital art. So let's select digital art. There is some of the additional controllers. So here comes the prompt or image description. It's a, an assistant step to our AI to understand what kind of details you want um, to introduce. And you need to describe your image as precise as possible. Try to avoid like general descriptions. So in our case, Super Mario character is pretty well known, pretty accurate character. So let's keep it like that. Then we have creativity and contrast. Contrast regulates the contrast of details, so I will recommend to keep it at 50%. You don't want it to be too drastic. Creativity, though, actually regulates how far our AI can go from the original image. So if you want something light and soft and keep close to original, um, try not to go beyond 30%. That would be enough. If you want more drastic changes, 40, 60, maybe 70 uh, would be enough. For the most drastic, dramatic changes, try 70 plus. But be careful, it might introduce some of the unexpected details. So I will keep it at 70, as we have pretty minimalistic image. Uh, let's click Start Processing. It usually takes 10, 20 seconds to process. This upscaler is a little bit slower comparing to other upscalers and it uses a little bit more powerful technology to redraw the image. Okay, here it goes. Let's download and check our results. So here we have the upscaled character and this is the original image. Uh, as you can see, a lot of details were completely redrawn. Our AI tried to imagine some eye color, small details, but overall the image is still pretty, pretty close to the original. So hopefully that helps. Please let us know your feedback as it's a new technology and we are constantly working on improvement. Thank you.